I'm sorry, Mr. Nesbitt. I can't issue you with a counter check if you don't have a bank account. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, my Chris, that's rich, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, aye. You have a bank account now, eh? Uh, see, I've been standing here for three hours, you know. I've been standing here for three hours while you buggers with your cracker jack pencils, <laughs> punts about in your, in your pinstripe suits and your pinstripe shirts and your, your pinstripe underpants. Well, let me tell you this, boy. It's people like you. It's people like you that spoil the broth, eh, hey, yeah? One, one in Kate Bush is worth ten in hand, eh, hey, yeah? <laughs> hey, I have a private income, I have a private income, there you are. There you are. You look at it. <laughs> my father was a lord, there you are. My father was a lord, owned half the country. There. And, and rented out the other half. <laughs> so, I don't need your Bartley Access American Club Diners, uh, Canadian Club Marks and Spencer's car, did ya? <laughs> you can stuff it. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't need it. But you see that pallet? See that? See that, yeah? That is my face. My face is my passport. It's got, it's got visa stamped on it, yeah. And I've passed my cycling proficiency. Hey, don't you come running to me. Don't you come running to me when the bogeyman's eating your last digestion. <laughs> if, Kitchener, if Kitchener was alive today and he said to me, Nesbitt, Nesbitt, your country needs you, I'd say, I'd say, piss off, Kitchener, it's your turn to buy a house, there you are. <laughs> and I'll tell you one more thing just before I go. See that? If you if you banks has got all this money, how come you how come you keep the pens chained up there? Eh? <laughs>